Hi guys, so I've been wanting to make a bunny YouTube channel for quite some time now, but I just did not know what I wanted to start with. So I figured I'd start with one of my favorite videos to watch, which is a bunny room tour. So let's get into it. Okay, so this is an overlay of their area in my bedroom. I got a loft bed so that I would be able to let them have more room because they before they just had this little area over here. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and start with Nala and Jackson's side of the room. In this corner, they have their gravity water, which gets changed every single day. And then we have their litter box that has two little hay racks in them. I don't know what they are actually used for. I got them from Walmart. And then I have an under the bed storage container as their litter box because it was bigger and they needed a bigger one. Then I have this tent which is from the Wish app that I love. I think it's super cute but only Nala uses it. Jackson doesn't really use it. Then over here we have their toy box which has toys from Small Pet Select and Binky Bunny and Amazon in there and they can just get them out whenever they feel like playing with them. The tote that Jackson is on is filled with their litter and I use horse stall bedding from Tractor Supply. There's also a memory foam mat on top of that so it's nice and comfortable for them. And then I have this little stool and this is from Five Below. It falls over super easy so I put this little rock underneath <laughs> It's like, it says love and that helps it stay up. I don't know why, but it does. Hi, dude. <laughs> and over here, they have this little cat tunnel that I got from Five Below and a hanging toy, which they don't really chew anymore. They used to chew it, but now they just kind of ignore it. Okay, now on to Piper's side of the room. She also has an under the bed storage container as a litter box. I used to just put hay in the litter box, but then I decided to use the little Living Worlds like hay wheel just so that she would always have some clean hay just in case she pottied on the other hay. She has the same toy box as the other two bunnies do, and it's also filled with kind of the same toys, a little bit different, but most of them are the same. And there's another tunnel that I got from Five Below. Um, over here she has her little water bowl and then we have my storage cubes which are mainly filled with bunny supplies but there's also some of my stuff in there. In this container right here there are extra treats and there's also grooming supplies and I got this little bow tie for Jackson. I've never put it on him but I thought it'd be cute to have. In this container, it's cleaning supplies and also willow chews because I, they didn't fit in the toy bin. So I have my spray bottle that has vinegar in it, paper towels, little whatever this is, duster, a duster pan, and then I have another mop pad in there. Then this is their toy bin. This has so many toys. I just, I'm not going to go through that. Down here I have my makeup. I just keep it in here because I got rid of my dresser so that they would have more room. It's kind of a mess, just ignore it. But this one has random like supplies that I need for them. So there's zip ties and duct tape. The duct tape sounds for them, but obviously it has scissors. There's wire cutters. Got the zip ties. This is a cord protector and I wrapped it up with an old headband. And then in this one, there is my hair stuff, and I mean, it's mainly hair stuff, but I also have lotion. Up top I have their treats and pellets. So I have some dried herbs. This is the Zen one from Small Pet Select. This one, I don't remember where I got this one from, to be honest. This one I made myself with herbs from the store. Then I have these from Small Pet Select. They're just pine cones, and Ella really likes these. These are the, some hay twists from Small Pet Select, but also from Binky Bunny. 
I have dried fruit and I dried this myself because I have a dehydrator. So there's mango and pineapple, strawberries. Um, I don't even remember what's in there. They don't get that too often. Then I have willow leaves, which I got from Binky Bunny. They love these. And then I keep their pellets in here and then keep the big bag in my closet. So these are Sherwood Pet Health pellets. And my bunnies love these. Right up here I have my succulents and I have a little basket in the middle. And that basket is kind of like all their emergency stuff. So I have syringes and some digestive tablets and... Um, I also have a kitchen scale in case I feel the need to weigh them. I used to have my critical care and um, the Sherwood Pet Health version of that up there, but now I keep that in the freezer because that is supposed to make it last longer. And this toe to keep their hay, I order 20 pounds from Small Pet Select, and it fits in this toe perfectly. I got this little bunny mat from Wish. In this corner of my room, I have all of my cleaning supplies. I have my broom in my dustpan. I have a mop and my little cordless vacuum. I love my cordless vacuum. It's really good about picking up bunny poop and hay. And I use that every single day to spot clean. But then I have like my shop vac down here. It's a mini one gallon one. And I use that every other day to do like a full clean. And I love that. It's perfect it doesn't get clogged and it's really small so it's easy to carry I also have a thing of vinegar because I use so much vinegar um, then I have my little shampoo where it's handheld for when they have accidents and in this basket I have a extension cord because the shop bags cord is not very long at all and I have a tunnel it's like a big one and then this is for shampooing the carpet but I don't really use that I just use vinegar Right over here, I have a really big garbage can because bunnies make a huge mess. If you have them, you know. And on top of their fridge, I keep their um, veggie plates. So after I wash them, I just put them up here because my mom didn't like having them in the kitchen. This is from my friend when I first got Jackson. This is... Um, the Rosewood Naturals like meadow menu pellets because I used to feed these too but they're really expensive to get here so I don't anymore I just give them a treats this is another bag of treats which they have destroyed because they <laughs> jumped up here one time I keep these up here so my mom can get them treats without having to climb over the fence and in their fridge I just have vegetables and some medicine and this is oh okay so that is the bunny room the rest of it's just my stuff which isn't super exciting so i'm not going to show that if you're wondering why they do not all live together it's because they are not bonded yet these two right here get along fine it's just nala over here does not like piper that much yet so hopefully They'll be bonded soon, and then they'll be able to have the whole area. I forgot to mention that each pen, each like side, has these little clippies, so I can just open it up and let them out. It's super easy, so when I need to let them out to exercise, it's really, really easy for me to do that. Obviously, they can't be out at the same time, because they don't get along yet. Jackson's chin is super wet. <laughs> They're so cute. Piper also has a memory foam mat, but she decided to pee on it right before I made this video, so that's being cleaned. Here comes Nala. Hello!